Beyond Imagination, Exploring the Frontiers of Technology and Innovation. Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Are you a person passionate about innovations? Have you ever wondered what are the frontiers of technology and innovation? If you are interested, you are in the right place. In today's video, we are going delve into the world of technology and explore the frontiers of technology and innovation. Before adventuring further, smash the like button and subscribe to never miss out on any of our videos. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. Exploring the frontiers of technology and innovation is an exciting journey and it involves pushing the boundaries of what is now possible and discovering new ways to solve problems and improve our lives. So now, let's look at a few areas where significant advancements and exploration are taking place. Artificial Intelligence Artificial intelligence is currently one of the hottest buzzwords in tech and with good reason. The last few years have seen several innovations and advancements that have previously been solely in the realm of science fiction slowly transform into reality. What is artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence is a method of making a computer, a computer-controlled robot, or software think intelligently like the human mind. AI is accomplished by studying the patterns of the human brain and by analyzing the cognitive process. The outcome of these studies develops intelligent software and systems. Why is artificial intelligence important? AI automates repetitive learning and discovery through data. Instead of automating manual tasks, AI performs frequent, high-volume, computerized tasks. And it does so reliably and without fatigue. Of course, humans are still essential to set up the system and ask the right questions. AI adds intelligence to existing products. Many products you already use will be improved with AI capabilities, much like Siri was added as a feature to a new generation of Apple products. Automation, conversational platforms, bots, and smart machines can be combined with large amounts of data to improve many technologies. AI adapts through progressive learning algorithms to let the data do the programming. AI finds structure and regularities in data so that algorithms can acquire skills. Just as an algorithm can teach itself to play chess, it can teach itself what product to recommend next online. And the models adapt when given new data. Quantum computing. Quantum computing is an area of computer science that uses the principles of quantum theory. Quantum theory explains the behavior of energy and material on the atomic and subatomic levels. Quantum computing uses subatomic particles, such as electrons or photons. Quantum bits, or qubits, allow these particles to exist in more than one state at the same time. Classical computers today employ a stream of electrical impulses, one and zero, in a binary manner to encode information in bits. This restricts their processing ability, compared to quantum computing. Quantum computing could contribute greatly to the fields of security, finance, military affairs and intelligence, drug design and discovery, aerospace designing, utilities, polymer design, machine learning, artificial intelligence, big data search, and digital manufacturing. Quantum computers could be used to improve the secure sharing of information, or to improve radars and their ability to detect missiles and aircraft. Another area where quantum computing is expected to help in the environment and keeping water clean with chemical sensors. Internet of Things The Internet of Things, also known as IoT, is a catch-all term for the growing number of electronics that aren't traditional computing devices, but are connected to the Internet to send data, receive instructions, or both. There's an incredibly broad range of things that fall under the IoT umbrella, internet-connected smart versions of traditional appliances such as refrigerators and light bulbs, gadgets that could only exist in an internet-enabled world such as Alexa-style digital assistants, and internet-enabled sensors that are transforming factories, healthcare, transportation, distribution centers, and farms. What is the Internet of Things? The IoT brings internet connectivity, data processing, and analytics to the world of physical objects. For consumers, this means interacting with the global information network without the intermediary of a keyboard and screen. In enterprise settings, IoT can bring the same efficiencies to manufacturing processes and distribution systems that the Internet has long delivered to knowledge work. Billions of embedded Internet-enabled sensors worldwide provide an incredibly rich set of data that companies can use to improve the safety of their operations, track assets, and reduce manual processes. 
Data from machines can be used to predict whether the equipment will break down, giving manufacturers advance warning to prevent long stretches of downtime. Researchers can also use IoT devices to gather data about customer preferences and behavior, though that can have serious implications for privacy and security. Augmented Reality and Virtual Reality We spend a lot of time looking at screens these days. Computers, smartphones, and televisions have all become a big part of our lives, they're how we get a lot of our news, use social media, watch movies, and much more. Virtual reality aka VR and augmented reality aka AR are two technologies that are changing the way we use screens, creating new and exciting interactive experiences. Virtual reality uses a headset to place you in a computer-generated world that you can explore. Augmented reality, on the other hand, is a bit different. Instead of transporting you to a virtual world, it takes digital images and layers them on the real world around you through the use of either a clear visor or a smartphone. Virtual reality immerses you in a virtual world through the use of a headset with some type of screen displaying a virtual environment. These headsets also use a technology called head tracking, which allows you to look around the environment by physically moving your head. Augmented reality allows you to see the world around you with digital images layered on top of it. There are currently a couple of AR headsets available, including the Microsoft HoloLens and the Magic Leap. However, they are currently more expensive than VR headsets and are marketed primarily to businesses. Biotechnology and Genetic Engineering Agricultural biotechnology is a range of tools that include both traditional breeding techniques and more modern lab-based methods. Modern biotechnology today includes the tools of genetic engineering. Genetic engineering is the name for the methods that scientists use to introduce new traits or characteristics to an organism. This process results in genetically modified organisms or GMOs. For example, plants may be genetically modified to produce characteristics to enhance the growth or nutritional profile of food crops. Now, let's see some benefits of modern biotechnology and genetic engineering. Advocates of modern biotechnology and genetic engineering say that the application of biotechnology in agriculture has resulted in benefits to farmers, producers, and consumers. First up, enhanced nutrition. Advances in biotechnology may provide consumers with foods that are nutritionally enriched longer-lasting or contain lower levels of certain naturally occurring toxins present in some food plants. Next, cheaper and more manageable production. Biotechnology may provide farmers with tools that can make production cheaper and more manageable. Lastly, improved pest control. Biotechnology has helped to make both pest control and weed management safer and easier while safeguarding crops against disease. Blockchain and Cryptocurrency A blockchain is a distributed database or ledger shared among a computer network's nodes. They are best known for their crucial role in cryptocurrency systems for maintaining a secure and decentralized record of transactions, but they are not limited to cryptocurrency uses. Blockchains can be used to make data in any industry immutable, the term used to describe the inability to be altered. Because there is no way to change a block, the only trust needed is at the point where a user or program enters data. This aspect reduces the need for trusted third parties, which are usually auditors or other humans that add costs and make mistakes. Since Bitcoin's introduction in 2009, blockchain users have exploded via the creation of various cryptocurrencies, decentralized finance applications, non-fungible tokens, and smart contracts. There you have it. The frontiers of technology and innovation are brimming with endless possibilities. From AI to blockchain and cryptocurrency, each frontier holds the promise of transforming our lives and shaping the future. If you find this video more insightful, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comments section and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.